<laughs> Yo, Kasami Nan, welcome back to Let's Play Yu-Gi-Oh! World Championship 2005, 7 Trials to Glory. That's the second time I had to do that because I wasn't recording the first time. Uh, so, yeah, I don't have, like, deck profiles to show off every single time we do this. Especially because we're about to hit a new week, but, um, Mai's here, so I want to beat her ass. Don't take that out of context. Hey, we won. Nice. Um, we're gonna go... Yeah, yeah, I wanna go second, right? Set one pass. Alright. I have a quick plane hand. What what is this? Oh, poison. Okay. That's fine. Um hmm. not many good offensive options to start with though. I guess I'll also be set passing. Uh reinforcements and Woboku. We'll set the Woboku. And the poison. That should be good to go. Hmm. She must have a really cloggy harpy hand or something. <laughs> like three harpy lady sisters or something. Um hmm. I kind of want to see if I can get over that set card. Screw it. Yeah. Let's some Mahavile. If it doesn't work out, well, you know. We tried. Uh, we're gonna set that in phase too. Case of, like, Trap Master shenanigans. Alright, Mahavalo attack over. Faith Bird. I don't remember how much defense that has. It doesn't matter. Okay. In phase two, we'll set this and pass our turn. Reinforcements does uh, beat Harpy Lady Sisters, so I'm pretty confident about that. Uh, also, Sky Scout, yeah. Ooh, premature burial for the Faith Bird too. Going all in. Um, yeah, let's uh, let's double your pain here. Faithbird cannot get over uh, Mahavila, so no and yes. During the damage step, which is what I assume that is, uh, reinforcements on Maha. Puts him at 2050, kills that. Gonna attack with Faithbird too, leave your uh, field by open. Thank you. Oh, that popped a uh, premature burial because it went back to the hand. That's funny. Okay. Ceasefire. Uh, alright. I have a lot of effect monsters in play, so that'll actually do quite a bit of burning. Um, I kind of want to get aggressive. I'd really like an equip spell for um, uh, Vilo, though. Fairy Meteor would actually be really good. As would, of course, Acts of Despair and stuff like that. Okay. I've got a Waboku set in case anything bigger than Mahavilo pops out. Nah, it's just Faith Bird again. Alright. I mean, if you kill Sangan, that's a plus for me, so. Well, actually, I break even, but <laughs> you know what I mean. Alright, let's activate Sangian, which is a mandatory effect, so we kind of have to. And let's see what we've got in here. Uh, Moth is not really what I need right now. Penguin Soldier might be alright. Maneater Old Vindictive. Um, mm, I don't know. Wish I had a second Sangian or a Witch of the Black Forest or something to start with this. 
Uh, I guess we'll go with penguin. Might be good in a pinch to bounce a uh, Vilo. Oh, well, don't need it. <clears throat> we just got the powerhouse herself. Ah, uh, I missed lethal, didn't I? No, no. That's only 400, and he's 1550, so that wouldn't have been lethal. Okay. I feel better about that. <laughs> All right, next turn we've got her as long as she doesn't do something super crazy. Oops, uh, nope. Harpy Lady plus Sister? Oh, Duster. Uh, mm, okay, I've got to, I've got to activate both of these then. Oh, I did miss Lethal because I had Ceasefire up. Wasn't able to play the... Oh, shit. Okay, well. There was no follow-up to it, so I guess it's not the worst. Uh, mm, okay. I guess I should have activated Ceasefire instead of Waboku. Now if I flip Hanehane, it'll just bounce itself. I do, however, have Ryukoki. I mean, this wins me the game, so should probably stop thinking too hard about it. Definitely an interesting one, though. I would really like a Harpy's Feather Duster or three of my own. <laughs> Alright. No problem. Since you've beaten me, but you better not tell anyone until I defeat you, that is... Okay. Alright, my home. There's uh, no one else to fight, so yeah. We'll just uh, go ahead and slap. So I've looked up how this works. We need to win six tournaments. So, uh, yeah. Otherwise, the KC Tower does not open up. Um, I just beat my, so I should be okay on DP. Yeah. Totes, my goats. Alright. Uh, I could open more of the dark. Oh, wait. I'm dumb. I need to figure out what the cards are. Alright, so we have banned Dark Hole, Ring of Destruction, Card Destruction, and Monster Reborn. Gross. Uh, limited, Change of Heart, Twin Swords, and Ceasefire. It's always funny how Twin Swords is in here. And no semi-limits. Which means Sangan is back to... Unlimited, but that doesn't matter because I only have one. Okay. Uh, let's check out our deck real quick. So we need to take out our Dark Hole. Whoops. Not more of them. <laughs> uh, Raigeki is never on that limited list, I just noticed. Ceasefire is okay. Ring is not. I wish I had a Sakuretsu armor. That would be a good replacement for, um, Ring of Destruction. But sadly, I don't. Okay, so I took out, um, Dark Hole and Ring of Destruction. What's limited now? I saw something good in there. I think it was Change of Heart. Um. Let's go with spells. It's always the spells. <laughs> There you are. Yeah, put one of those in. Actually, haven't I... Didn't I just pull a witch to the Black Forest not too long ago? Trying to remember. I don't think that works too well.
I really wish I could make Swarm of Locusts work. Oh yeah, I got Tsukuyomi. Uh, Tsukuyomi's pretty good. Stealth Bird isn't bad either. I don't know what the fuck this thing is. Uh, your opponent cannot activate a quick play. It's interesting. I think I said that the last time I pulled it too, but you know. <laughs> um, oh, Gale Lizard. That's like a... It's like Hane Hane, but bigger. On top of that, it's also a better effect. <laughs> so yeah, let's, let's go on that. There's two things that make this better. Okay, it's not actually uh, an optional effect. But it says your opponent's side of the field. So if you flip him and he's by himself, he's not going to bounce himself. So that's pretty nice. <laughs> Uh, what else are we throwing in here? Oh, actually, I'm, I'm good with the Tsukuyomi and Gale Lizard, and I just uh, take out my Hane Hane. Don't even really need it in the side deck, but it, uh, it's too confusing to get to it, so I'm just going to not... <laughs> <laughs> Alright, uh, I have enough for a dark pack, so I might as well. Oh, apparently these packs unlock based on what week you're in. Volume 8 is available, and I think that's the Gravekeeper's one? Is it? Was it 8 or 9? Ugh, I'm gonna need to look that up again. Uh, until then, though... One dark pack. See what we got. Whoops. See what we got. Mataza the Zapper. I have absolutely... Oh, Mad Dog. Uh, Mad Dog's pretty cool. He's 1900. That's it. He's definitely coming in, though. <laughs> Mataza the Zapper. So once you're going to attack twice during the same battle phase, as long as the card remains face up on the field control, this card cannot switch. That's dumb. <laughs> We're definitely not playing that. Another freaking Serpent Knight. Come on, man. Okay. Well, um... Yeah, let's, uh, let's sort this by attack. And then just find... Oh, I think I have a Neo in here still. Is Mahavilo still good? I don't know. These are all effect monsters and stuff, and I kind of need them. At the same time, do I need three walls? I don't want to cut down on my offensive options. But I really like seeing wall in my opening hand. Um, no, I have a Sangin in the search wall, so I feel like this is correct. Oops. Alright, and sort this by attack. And right at the top will either be, oh yeah, Goblin Attack Force. <laughs> um, uh, Mad Dog. Perfect. Our Vanilla Beaters just keep getting Speedier. Uh, I don't know where I was going with that. Let's go. Back home. And then sleep. Alright. Our usual routine of sleeping through a hundred days. Oh, I'm being pinged in Discord. Ah, eh. Okay. Right, there's a huge thing that pops up when there's a tournament, so... Yeah, there we go. Okay. The weekend tournament preliminaries, blah, 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 blah. We've heard this a hundred times. Oh, we have a... The, the fat guy. Cool.
Well, now that I'm playing an even more aggressive deck, I definitely want to go second. Ah, uh, I got Summon Scald in the opening hand, but no change of heart. A change of heart would have been great on this board, though. Ooh, Mahavilo plus Nuzzler. I just need to make sure that thing doesn't, like, bounce anybody. If it's like a Hane Hane or whatever to bounce my Sing again, that's perfectly fine. Job Change Mirror? It, I'm sorry, is that what that's called? It is. I've never seen this card in my entire life. Okay. I definitely don't want a Nuzzler on the sand again. That seems like a waste. Eh, if he kills it, he kills it. Sangan's there is basically a sacrificial pawn, so. Yep, there's the Celtic Guardian. Perfectly fine. Get over that Sangan. Now I'm gonna get the search. What are we looking? Um, Wall of Illusion wouldn't be bad. Magician of Faith is terrible on this board. Uh, ah, I can't search Kaelos because it's 14. Nice. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I think wall's good. It's a shame I don't have more chances to do Magician of Faith, considering, you know. Alright, uh, Mahavilo plus Nuzzler equals a really, really large Mahavilo. And we'll go battle and swing on over this uh, Celtic Guardian you've left. Very defenseless. Alright, and now we're in the lead. In terms of card advantage, I'm also a little bit in the lead, too. <clears throat> Thanks to the um, Sangon search. Alright, uh, we'll go with this. I don't need Tsukuyomi at the moment. Let's go with Kaiku. Kaiku is always a pretty solid choice. Alright. Well, let's have Kaiku swing over this. And we'll have Mahavila do the same to this. It's an effect. It's Hane Hane. I was a little bit afraid of that. Alright, um, yeah, I'm gonna definitely activate the middle of the Nuzzler effect, because I did just get back my Mahavilo. And we're still sitting on Kaiku Wabuku, so I'm not too worried. Still no set spells and traps. It's kind of weird. Uh, alright. Uh, gee, I wonder what I'll draw. Okay. Um, well, I mean, yeah, let's go with the Mahavilo plus... Mmm, I should have waited. I should have waited until main phase two. But I, I, uh, I'm being greedy here. Okay. I actually want... Uh, I want this to go this way. Okay, it's just Wolf. Literally just named Wolf. Alright. And Kaiku, so he can banish a couple of things out of that grave... Uh, let's go with Honey Honey for sure. Don't want that to come back and then get Book of Moon or something. And I don't know, Celtic Guardian, sure. <laughs> okay, just ripping things out of his graveyard because I can. Next turn I might go Summon Skull. Summon Skull Tribute Sangan would have been amazing, but sadly, lost the ability to do that play. Um, Old Vindictive's pretty good. Uh, go Wall of Illusion. Next turn I can Tribute that. I want to be mindful of the 2000 defense... Monsters. Besides, this is how Kaiku gets his effect. So. I 
I'm just removing them at random. Whatever's on top, or in this case on the bottom. <laughs> Grappler. Okay. Are you gonna attack into my wall? Cool. <laughs> well, that's pretty much game set match. Doesn't really matter what I draw here. Gale Lister is cool though. Alright, into that battle phase, and yeah, just go in with Mojave, because uh, I'll get 300 no matter what. People online do suggest for GP grinding to face off against Taya a bunch, because she has that stupid deck that heals her. And I'm like, yep, I definitely see the logic behind that. I mean, I'm not going to do that because it's boring as hell, but, you know, can. <clears throat> Alright. I did just get 300 DP and I could get a pack, but, eh. Let's just go straight for it. Who's it gonna be? It's Weevil. It's friggin' Weevil again. <laughs> okay. Um, actually, wasn't it Rex last time? I know I fought Weevil at one point, I just don't remember when. Alright, I lost. That's fine. He's making me go second anyway. Uh, against his deck, I actually kind of want to go first, actually. Alright. Uh, I have desktop muted again, don't I? God damn it. <laughs> Just remember that. Okay. Gear Freed, Exo Despair, Harpy's Brother, Tsukuyomi, Mad Dog. Uh, let's summon Mad Dog and see if it gets hold. Okay. That's fine. Hopefully he can't kill me on turn three somehow. Jiragumo. Well, that's a that's a start. <laughs> Call the coin toss wrong? Damn it. Also, Jiragumo's big. He's a, he's a big boy. Um, how do I want to get rid of him? I could Book of Moon Tsukuyomi him. Tsukuyomi does lose to Shrapple, though. Uh, I mean, if he Shrapple's again, I'm kind of dead. <laughs> so I might need to just do something defensive. Hmm. This is a weird position. Alright. We're gonna set Sing in and see what happens. Okay. That doesn't actually get over Sing in. Oh, wait. Yes, it does. Because he has a thousand attack and defense. Well, shit. Okay. Um, maybe he'll call the Jirakuma wrong this time? <laughs> uh, I kind of want to go with Penguin Soldier, actually. Okay, cool. He at least lost half of his life points. But we're definitely, uh, <laughs> not looking too good. Chaser's cool, I guess, but, uh, yeah, we're gonna set the penguin. Okay. Um, my hand's getting really cloggy. Okay. Use penguin soldier to bounce. Uh, I don't really care about bouncing the thousand guy. I will definitely bounce Jiragumo or I'll die. <laughs> and you know what? Let's let's bounce the one you just set. Just to just to punish you for it. Okay. Uh oh trap hole on the Jiragumo summon. Nice. Alright. Um let's see if he has it. No, I should go Harpy's brother because I can equip him with axe. Torrential! Okay. Torrential's actually fine. <clears throat> Call the hunt is less so, but whatever. 
There's the Gummo gun. He has the seven tools, I kinda die here. Okay. Torrential Tribute. Mm. It's a hell of a card. Another trample, that's good. Uh let's go for mechanical. Please don't have a Oh my god! Okay. This dude just has all the answers, doesn't he? Uh he's gonna just keep poking me with this meanie. Okay, what could that be? Well, another trapple would suck. Oh, giant grenade, thank god. <laughs> uh you son of a bitch. The fact he wanted to block that definitely, uh, doesn't make me happy. Um, okay. Let's go, Gearford. If he trap pulls it, I die. Okay, cool. <laughs> Sadly, I can't equip him with Axe, so we'll just, uh, we'll just attack him. <clears throat> cool. Okay, uh, I wouldn't say I'm back in control yet, but... Oh, now I am. Unless that's a seven tools back there. That would suck. Oh, fuck. Uh, okay, I'm not dead. It's definitely not looking good, though. I need to draw something that I can out this with. Either... Fissure or a monster with more than 1200 attack. Awesome. <laughs> okay. Uh, I have Tsukuyomi and Ryukoku. Uh, hmm, that kind of sucks. <sighs> or flip face up. Okay, cool. So it does go off when it's flipped. Um, seems good to me, then. <clears throat> No outs to Tsukuyomi. I'm tempted to tribute it. I kind of have to. He's kind of just stuck there at this point. Uh, if that's another trap hole or something, though, I kind of lose. Yeah, I need to play this smart. <clears throat> okay, Sengen can't get over uh, Tsukuyomi, so it's fine. <clears throat> and we'll have Tsukuyomi book himself? Herself? I don't, I don't know. Uh, that's actually a tough one. It bounces either way, right? No, okay. Because its effect isn't still active while it's face down. How many monsters do I have in here? Because it feels like a lot. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six times three. Only 18. I guess that's fine, though. And the fact that his original attack is zero when he hits the field is uh, definitely nice because it gets around trap. Um, I'm going all in. Especially because I'm afraid of what that Sanging can search. Uh, hmm. If I flip Tsukuyomi, it flips the Sangan. And then I win. Oh, actually, I, I won either way. <laughs> I'm dumb. Oh, well. Uh, Tsukuyomi kills Sangan. This is a mirror force. I'm gonna eat my controller. Oh my god! Well. Time to dig in. <laughs> no. Oh. Uh. I should have. I should have fished up the sink in! <laughs> Fuck! Oh, god damn it. <sighs> what the hell was I thinking with that Tsukuyomi play, man? I was not playing around Mirror Force at all. Shit. 
Okay, uh, ceasefire is not gonna quite get me there, but, you know, it's there. <laughs> it's not something. <laughs> How am I still alive? That misplay should have ended my entire career. Alright, well, let's go with Gemini. Uh, ceasefire only works on flip effects. Sangan's gonna go to search either way. It's probably gonna be fucking man eater bug or something, too. Which definitely sucks. Oh, actually, no, it doesn't, because I have ceasefire set. The. I need to look that up. I need to look that up, because I have no idea what the fuck that is. And it's supposed to be common knowledge, or, er, uh, public knowledge. Gruesome goo. Uh, let's see. You are. 1300, 700 vanilla. Yeah, okay. Fun fact, in Japanese, it's called the Killer Blob. Or Kira Blob. Ah, fuck. That's not good. That's not good. Um, I'm dead here? What do I have set? Ceasefire. Yeah, no, I'm dead. Shit. Oh, that was the misplay of the century. Fuck. Alright. Alrighty, um, I just need to play better. <laughs> That's all it really is. Uh, what's in my side deck? Why do I even have this? Um, Swarm of Locusts might actually be good here. Uh, no, we're just gonna go for it. I think I would have won if I had not played like shit. <laughs> As per most Yu-Gi-Oh tools. Well, this is a pretty sick first hand, I'll tell you that. Okay. Um, I know he has Jiragumo and stuff, so Trap Hole's great. Uh, Despelled Check Traps, cool. Um, set Wall, Set Trap. Set. Not that. Um, we're good to go. <sighs> you couldn't. You couldn't have. You couldn't have done this more beautifully if you tried. <laughs> Stupid bitch. Okay. Um, I kind of want to summon skull, but I also. Hmm, this is like one of the few times I'll be able to play around trap hole. Uh no, I've got to go Gearford. I need my Wall of Illusion set. Uh, we'll go reinforcements too. Yeah. All right. Sink in for that eighteen. Puts him at sixty-two. Good, good. Alright, what you got, boy? An another Jiragumo. Funnily enough, that does not get over Gearfruit once I activate him. <clears throat> oh, and he loses half his life points. <laughs> Fucking beautiful. So that happens on attack declaration. And this happens in the damage stuff. Mm. That's some synergy right there. Um, I win? I win. I definitely win. I just need to tribute the Wall of Illusion for Summon Skull and beat in. Alright, a nice, quick, decisive game two. But now we're going into that all-important... No, I'm not gonna copy MVT. But we are going into game three. So, uh... Let's see how go. Let's see if my draw not shit. He's going first, of course. Because he's a little bitch. Have we had a round three up until this point, actually? I don't think I've lost any of these before. 
So that's definitely making things interesting. Alright, uh, Gale Lizard to start is pretty good. Change of Heart plus Ryukoki, also pretty good. Um, let's just figure out what that thing is there in the background. It is a trap hole. Okay. That's, uh, that's some interesting information then, because they'll just get trap -holed. Um, I kinda don't want that. So we'll save the change of heart until I can, um, either get rid of the trap hole somehow, or with, like, a giant grenade. Or if I can bait him out with it. Now I don't know what the second set is, though. Uh, Chaos Necromancer plus Malevolent Nelson might not be too bad if I had any monsters in the graveyard. Let's just go with Gale Lizard. It is, as mentioned, Hane Hane, but bigger. <laughs> bigger and better. In pretty much every way. We're going all in with the attacks, aren't we? Alright, uh, I guess I'll have Gale Lizard bounce the... Actually, I'm gonna have you bounce the set. Ah, I was hoping to bait him into an attack with up. Alright, a trap hole in my own. That's pretty cool. It doesn't get rid of his trap hole, though, so it kind of still doesn't do me much good. He'd be at a thousand at this point. That'd be cool, I guess. <laughs> yeah. Ah, there we go. Take your 400. Okay, full back row, huh? <laughs> uh, let's see if I can bait out a magic jammer. Cool. Magic jammer is A-OK -okay with me. Why did he discard so much? Ah, uh, he didn't. Yo, he discarded main eater bug. <laughs> what is this AI? Okay, um... Yeah, I still can't do anything. Alright. We call the hunt. On bug. That's only good if you have, like, squeal me, though. Ooh, that's scary. Uh, yeah, let's get rid of that. <laughs> uh, seven tools? Yeah. Okay. He gets bounced, so it's not the end of the world. Um, that'll put my thing now at 1300. But he has a Jiragumo in hand. Hmm. Am I about to lose this one too? Uh, damn it! I don't have Dark Hall. Um, draw. Okay. This baits the trap hole. <laughs> Fuck. Um. Damn it, I don't know what to do here. Uh, uh, I'm at 6,600 life. There's probably not too much of a chance he'll kill me, right? The next turn I can use the change of heart on Jiragumo, steal it. Okay, good. As long as he doesn't have a Rex Circle Slave hand or something. Ah, I would have really liked to get that life point loss. That kind of would have sealed the game, actually, I think. <laughs> Rikoki over a man-eater bug. He just set another card. <laughs> okay. Ne Necromancer's at what? Um, 900 plus 700 is 15? That does get over both of these. Uh... uh I have no way to get rid of... Jiraguma, though. <laughs> I've got to go for this. I kind of don't have a choice. Alright. Change of heart. Declare target. Jiraguma. Okay. So far, so good. Tribute summon. Jiraguma. Ryukoku. I just realized that was his original card. Oh, damn it. This is such an irritating deck to play against. 
Uh, uh, okay, well, if he draws another Jiragumo, I die. But if he doesn't, then I'm good. Fourteen fifty plus nine hundred. That's not enough. That's just barely not enough. Oh god. Okay. 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 I am somehow, some way, still in this. I don't know how. <laughs> uh, I think reinforcements actually does beef up my uh, chaos necromancer enough. This chaos necromancer is becoming like my freaking um, ace monster. Uh, man eater bug will cost me to lose, so uh, we gotta go with the necromancer play. He starts at zero, so trap bolt doesn't affect him. Level nuzzler. I am. Terrified of uh, Mirror Force, though. So we'll just end. We'll just end. If he summons like Empress Mantis or whatever, I have reinforcements, so it's not a huge deal. Shit. Shit. Okay, well, you win some, you lose some. Uh... Wait a fucking second. That was his second change of heart, wasn't it? No, that, that was the other game. Judge? <laughs> God, I punted that first game. Punted it so hard. God, I'm gonna kick myself for that. Okay, well, we got 300 DP. Let's go drown our sorrows in the card shop. As I tend to do in real life. <laughs> 495? Yeah, I've got enough. Uh, <laughs> so mad. Alright, let's see if I can get a freaking witch. Beastro Butcher is shit. What the fuck is a monster eye? You can return Polymoon from your graveyard to your hand. But I could do that with Magician of Faith for free. Um, oh yeah, I don't know what this is. Uh, you can sub this month's, this card for one fusion material monster. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, I'm great, Barkar. <laughs> Yeah, okay. Man, I'm just whiffing all over today. Uh, we might need to go back to the drawing board. I lost this just a billion trap holes though. I need a I need a side trap master again. What a, why haven't I done that? Okay. Uh, trap master, trap master, there. Okay. That is a must against Weevil. Ah, I'm so mad! <laughs> Alright. It's a new week, it's a new day, it's a new life for me. Um, I think that's kind of how that work went, anyway. Still gonna enter the tournament, because I still need to win six of them. Uh, okay. I might want to do that Teo grinding off screen. So I can get a massive amount of packs. Ooh, volume 9 is now available. Harpy Lady plus Gravekeepers, maybe. I would like the Harpies, though. <clears throat> Alright. Wait, no. I need, I need to figure out how to build my deck. Okay. What do we got? Dark hole, card destruction, change of heart, ring of destruction. I really hate it when card dark holes banned, because I have no alternatives to it. 
I can now play Monster Reborn at 1, though. And Sengen's at 2 blues. Oh, so is Mataza the Zapper. What? <laughs> Why would you put that on the list ever? It's such a silly card. Okay. Okay. Um, so the limited ones I can put in... Uh, Monster Reborn for change of heart. That's pretty good. Okay. That's pretty much the only real change I need to make, so, no. We'll just go with it. Uh, in some ways, Monster Reborn kind of helps me more, because I can play around Trap Hole with it. So, yeah. Okay. Alright. My goal is to try and do three tournaments a week. Sadly, that got, uh, shafted. <laughs> I'm still gonna do three, but my goal is also to win them. Oh well, I have uh, tuned the deck just in case of more Weevil. So, uh, yeah, let's get through this first scrub. Blind second would be so much better with a card like Cyber Dragon. Alright, um, what are we doing here? Well, set in seven tools for sure. Ooh, Fairy Meteor. Uh, that's a pretty good one. Let's see if I can summon Mechanical Chaser without nonsense. Okay. Wait, did I have Giant Trinade in hand? God, I am playing super sloppy right now. Okay. Refocus. That plus Island Turtle. Okay. Um, what's my second? It was reinforcements, wasn't it? Okay, Harpy's brother. Uh, seven tools. That's right. Oh God damn it! <laughs> <coughs> okay, let's try nade. Summon out the Harpy's brother so he isn't killed, and then go to battle. And we'll set the seven tools in the too. Kill the Island Turtle, because if he flips the other one into defense, I have a way to get around that. Okay. We're back in control of this. I honestly should have been from the start, but I'm an idiot. That's a big boy. That's a really big boy. I can't do anything to it. Help! Okay. Uh, he just said seven tools. Oh, Tsuk! Tsuk cannot get over that. D uh, Manier Bug. <laughs> okay. Here's hoping he attacks with the weenie. Okay, cool. Not playing around the set man eater old detective. It's fine with me. Okay. I can suit that. But then I'm defenseless next turn, so I don't know how good that is. Um do I have anything for Magician of Faith to bring back? Well, that would not be the worst. Um, definitely don't want to equip the Tsukuyomi with Fairy Major. Oh, actually, Tsukuyomi can't get over that. That's kind of annoying. Um, I guess I'll just set the Tsukuyomi. And the poison. Water Girl! Okay. <laughs> no attack. Interesting. Uh, 
That's not really what I need, game. Where are my damn 1850, 1900 beaters on this deck? He's summoned nothing that can get over Tsukiyomi, by the way. <laughs> I find that kind of funny. Alright, I'm off to get back my Trunade. It's not the greatest, but it's not the worst. Uh, I could activate Poison. Uh, no I can't, because it's damaged up somehow. How did I miss the attack declaration? Okay, well, whatever. I wasn't gonna bring back Poison anyway, so... And Tsukuyomi, I guess it'll just flip itself. Anything good? Ooh! 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 <laughs> and even if he has like a magical jammer or whatever. Uh, magic jammer that is. Um, I have seven tools set. So yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, now I have a nice big beefy boy on my side of the field. Let's clean this up. Amazing. Let's see what you got. Yeah, that's what I thought. Why'd you go to battle phase? <laughs> Alright, well, uh, Fairy Meteor Crush is about to start putting in some massive work. Uh, I have, what, three monsters in Grave? Four. That does make him twelve. Eh, he gets over, like, one thing, so, sure. Let's have Chaos Necromancer join in on the party. And activate Fairy Meteor Crush. It's normally for Mahavilo, but, uh, I mean, Cybertech Alligator can definitely put in some work with it, too. Cybertech Alligator was a one tribute, wasn't it? Huh. Interesting. So it's a lot like Summon Skull in that way. Am I remembering that correctly? Yeah, he's a level 5! Holy shit! <laughs> but he's not searchable with Witch of the Black Forest, so Summon Skull's still better. <laughs> I mean, you know, assuming I had a goddamn Witch of the Black Forest. I know it exists in this game. I've seen it in all the card lists. Alright. What you got? Fire Yato. Oh. Because it... Because it gets over... It gets over my freaking uh... Chaos Necromancer. That's cute. Attack Declaration and damage stuff. Cool. I win. Lost control of that game for a minute, and then I drew Monster Reborn and just, like, cleaned house. So, yeah. That's how it goes sometimes. Alright. Drew into that big, beefy bomb. What? It, no. Wait. That's not enough. 
Luckily, I have Poison in the Old Man set, so I can cowboy for a game. <laughs> that term will make more sense when we get to the XC zero, by the way. Okay. Do, 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 do. <sighs> okay. Um, I think I'm ready for a match. Screw it. Let's just let's just go and do it. If I lose this time, I'm gonna end the stream and then figure out something to do with this deck. Alright, who's it gonna be? Mako. Okay. I feel pretty confident about against Mako Tsunami. The only scary thing would be, like, uh, Torrential Tribute. So, uh, yeah. Need to be mindful of that. It's actually a card that exists that searches Torrential Tribute and also does extra stuff if you've got water monsters. But, um, yeah. I don't think that exists yet. Uh, man, having Gemini plus reinforcements plus seven tools plus Wovoku plus a monster reborn in backup seems pretty good to me. <laughs> it's a pretty strong opener, if I do say so myself. Gemini Elf set three. All right, what can get over this board? Uh, well, Harpy's Feather Duster would make me sad. <laughs> no, just a set monster. If I drew Fairy Meteor, that'd be pretty cool. Hmm. Uh, uh, that, 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 that. <laughs> okay. Um. I kind of want to play Harpy's Brother. Yeah, no, I have a seven tool set, so even if that's a torrential tribute, I can out it. No, okay. Let's see if that set monsters a Meteor Buck? Why would Mako Tsunami be playing fucking Maneater Bug, though? Ah, oh, Maiden of the Aqua. Oh, uh, she's 2000. Uh, I guess I'm gonna have to do it this way. <laughs> Otherwise, I can't get over it. She does, like, an extra thing or something, right? Uh, this fi the field is treated as Umi. Oh, okay. That's pretty neat. Because there's some cards that interact with that. So I'm glad I got rid of it. Because <clears throat> he's sure to have those cards. Uh, we can just end. I'm feeling it pretty good. Got that uh, Waboku 7 tools set, so. Ooh, Legendary Ocean. There it is. Okay. But that. That's it. Excuse me? What? <laughs> I'm, I'm a little confused there, my, my my good sir. Uh, okay. Ooh, Monster Reborn could be really fun on this field, actually. Uh, let's set the man bug. Just in case he pulls out, like, Legendary Fisherman or something. I'll be ready for it. Tornado Wall would be really annoying. So hopefully he never ever uses that. <laughs> uh, this is treated as Umi, so yeah, Tornado Wall would work. There. Yeah, all water monsters that are like level 5 or whatever can be normal summon now. Thankfully the pool's not huge, but Legendary Fisherman does fit into that category and he's scary. Um, okay, well, might as well play Mechanical Chaser. Um, do you have anything to stop this? Mako? Hello? Gemini? Direct attack? Game? Okay, cool. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know what those set cards were, but <laughs> it's whatever, I guess. Alright. Um, I don't really need to sign or Yeah, I think we're good. Okay. Maybe I should side deck Legendary Fisherman just for this matchup. That'd be funny. 
Of course, I'd need to pull one. <laughs> okay. Uh, wait, am I going first or is he going first? He's going first. Okay. Fortress Whale's Oath. Holy crap. Well, um, uh, was not expecting that right off the bat. Uh, how do I out this? can't. I just, I just can't. Okay. Uh, not with this hand, anyway. Uh, well, let's try to pull. I could really use a trench of my own. Um, I guess we'll set Mad Dog and just hope for the best. That did use a lot of cards, so. He is down to, like, nothing. The thing is, he has a massive-ass Fortress Whale on the field. Okay, this outs it. Not directly, obviously. But I can go into either, like, Old Vindictive or Penguin or literally anything else. Maiden of the Aqua actually cannot be killed by Trap Hole. That's kind of annoying. Um, yeah, I'm actually liking... Uh, Penguin Soldier here. For one, it's a water monster. <laughs> Alright, I'll take this direct attack. No problem. The problem would be if you have a follow-up. Okay. Uh, set the Penguin Soldier I just totally drew. Could be anything. Go ahead. Alright, now you gotta figure out how to get past this without flipping it up. That's not gonna do it, my friend. He went, he went in no fear, even though I just searched Penguin Soldier. Uh, that's fine with me. Bounce them both. Especially the Fortress Whale, because that basically outs it forever. Um, I'm gonna True Nade Nail. That way I can, uh, summon... Ooh. I should summon Kaiku. I can get rid of these, uh, Maiden the Aquas. Whoops. I was gonna summon Mechanical Chaser, but that's only 50 more damage, and, uh, Kaiku's effect is more beneficial at this moment. Next time I'll get rid of that Penguin Soldier. If there is a next time. Uh, okay. Set the seven tools, set the trap hole. Now I can't out either of these very easily either. So this is definitely working out for me. A second one? And then he tributed it. That, that was a huge mistake, my guy. You should have just stuck with the fortress wheel. So, uh, have a trap hole. Okay, uh, I know what two targets I'm getting rid of. For sure. This is a great board, by the way. <laughs> Alright, even if that's like Mirror Force or whatever, I have some tool set, so. It's not. I have absolutely no idea what cards he sets. Are they bluffs? Because I'm, I, I can never get bluffed. I, I always go for it no matter what, which definitely lands me in some trouble. There are two fortress whales in here. I don't like that. Um, I'm gonna leave the amphibian beast. I'll probably live to regret that. Uh, yeah, we're gonna get rid of both of them. I don't know if he has a card like. I don't know, Monster Reincarnation or something to get those back, but just in case. I can't out those with Trap Hole and stuff, so. Legendary Ocean. Um, okay. <laughs> it's whatever to me. I should also side deck Seven Colored Fish, just for, <laughs> just for this matchup. Okay, um... I win if I don't, like, 
overextend, so let's not do that. I will, however, activate Kaiku's effect. Not a Woboku. I don't I don't know what he has set. I'm so confused. Okay. What? Uh no, I don't know. Wait, no. Uh, uh, whatever. Uh, I'll, I win. You're incredibly tough. You must be the biggest fish in the sea. Uh, sure, let's go with that. Alright. Yay, we did it. Woo! 700 DP. I feel like if I do the tail grind, though, it's like a bit, I don't know, disingenuous. I'm of two minds of it. Anyway, uh... Three? No, I can do four. Cool. Let's go. Gotta pull something good in these four packs, right? Nope. Hmm. Sarah. Okay. No. Oh! Gravekeeper's Guard. Nice! Uh... Another Chaos Necromancer is alright, I guess. Uh... Giant Oak. That's supposed to be Giant Orc. Total defense. Ugh. Still nothing. Man. What the fuck? Huh. Una zombie. Huh. <laughs> um. Zera's nice and big. If I had his ritual, it would be pretty cool. Labyrinth tank. Okay. That's a weird mixture. Zoa, which is not very good because Metal Morph. A metal Zoa. Interesting. Which is Apprentice is interesting. I don't know if I'd play it though. Skull Knight. Tainted Wisdom plus Ancient Brain. Skull Knight is made of two brains? What? Uh, Baron of the Fiend Sword. I feel like I've seen this thing before. Uh, Grand Tiki Elder. Trash. Science Soldier? Super Trash. Dark Magi... Gross Ghost of... Flood... Yum Yum. Ooh, Nudoria! This card is pretty cool. If it's sent to the graveyard as a result of battle, uh, he basically may need her bugs. Gravekeeper's Guard is just Hane Hane, but really fucking huge. Actually, he's just Gale Lizard, but really huge now. So, definitely gonna play him. I don't know about a second Chaos Necromancer. I now have two Stealth Birds. And two more Invader of Darkness. Okay. I've seen worse pulls. I guess. <laughs> Alright, well, let's, uh, let's put in the... It's kind of a shame. I did like Gale Lizard, but never got a chance to shine. Sad day. Uh, there you are. Wait, where to go? Gale Lizard out, and which is I I saw that and I thought it was fucking. Nidoria and Gravekeeper's Guard in, and we'll also take out the Bug. I feel like Old Vindictive has a bit more synergy options with him. Being a spellcaster. But I don't actually know. It's probably no real difference in the end. Okay. I wonder if anyone news popped up. Not particularly. Unless that's uh, Yami Bakura. You are not Yami Bakura. Okay. 
And in that case, we'll just, uh, we'll just go, we're gonna go home. Sleep time. Night, night. Okay. Uh, let me see. Okay. 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 Uh, what's going on with KC Tower? Have I won five yet? I've only won, or uh, I haven't won five, six. I've won five. Yeah. Okay. All right. Let's see what the cards are. See what the cards are. Okay. Ooh, no bans. Lots of limits, though. Holy shit. That is so many limits. I don't even know. Oh, you can remove from this screen. That's neat. How do I uh, put them in, though? Okay. Well, if there are no bans, we're gonna go. Full on crazy. Except for the twin swords. Those are still shit. Um, give me back my dark hole, thank you. Uh I still I still don't like card destruction though. Change of heart for sure. And I believe there's also a trap. Whoops, not that one. Uh, Ring of Destruction. Cool. Alright, now I need to figure out what cards to take out. Definitely not, definitely not. I need to sort this by something that makes sense. Okay. Um, Via Koki's super underperformed for me, so we're gonna take a minute. Uh, honestly, Mahavila can get so huge, though. So stupidly huge. Um, I still like this Wall of Illusion Gravekeeper's Guard combo, so we're gonna stick with that. <clears throat> I especially need my Magician of Faith when I've just put in a bunch of power spells. Um, I don't need D spell anymore, but we will. Uh, God damn it! Screw it. I was gonna say we'll put it in the side deck, but fuck it. Um, at forty-one, Woboku. Chaos Necromancer's coming too clutch for me. Uh, yeah, Woboku's fine. Okay. We'll go with that. <clears throat> Meh. Okay. Uh, I did register, right? <laughs> I hope so. Because uh, I'm going to lose my chain. We can turn them in four days away. Okay. Cool. Alright, we'll do one more and then call that good. We could use more grind time in uh, Shining Force anyway. Alright, here we go. Preliminaries against some rando. It's Ball Cap Boy again. Alright. You only think you're making us go second when it's actually what I want. Hmm? Oh, I drew poison. I'm like, what? God damn it, now I need to go second draw. Okay. Uh, Sangian's start is pretty good. Actually, I really like that because if I get trap hold, I can at least activate his effect. No? Okay. 
good information. Unless they just won't trap Paul Sangin or a witch. Ooh. That actually works out for me. Um, I'm gonna grab my guard. Let's get the new boy in here. The new really beefy boy in here. Our monarchs are a thing in this game. Um, well, I definitely want to set ceasefire, just not right now. Yeah, let's go with Voice Raider. Still no trouble. Alright, um... End our battle. If it's the second man eater, it's kind of whatever. A little annoying, but I can deal. It is honey honey. Okay. I can deal with that even better. <clears throat> to uh, unclog my hand, we'll go ahead and set both of these. <coughs> Pretty slow game to start. I could poison the old man and negate the 1200 damage here, but no. <laughs> There's no reason to do that. Hmm, set another. I don't like that. Don't like that at all. But I don't have much of a choice. Uh here we go, Kike. No, actually. Mm, I don't like that sec card. We're just gonna do this. Did not go for it. Alright, uh, let's see what your set cards are, boyo. Kaiku the Ghost Destroyer. Nope, we're good. Uh, maybe Mirror Force then? Kaiku Attack? gonna get rid of those uh <clears throat> hmm. you're usually able to remove the one you destroyed or maybe you're not interesting okay <clears throat> I guess that is when he deals the battle damage and that's during damage calculation so the monster has not been technically destroyed yet Aquamador, what are you up to? Oh, you're gonna attack the set card, aren't you? Oh, no. Then why'd you just leave him in attack like that? <clears throat> okay, well, uh, whatever. <coughs> I can go ahead and take advantage of that. Summon the Vorsus with the mostest. Uh, Kaiku again. Actually, I should have attacked with the Vorsus Raider and used Kaiku's effect on the other one. But just whatever. God damn it. I hate the way that interaction works. Two effect monsters on field so far. But I'd need to get my guard and I don't want to do that. Hmm. 
Not a huge fan of Change of Heart, but I can't really do anything about it. Yeah. Alright, let's have you bounce that summon skull. <clears throat> A little late on the trap hole there again. Thanks. Uh, actually, what's that new Doria? So he'll either get bounced or blown up. You go ahead. Bean sword is pretty whatever. It does kill Nidoria following off, but Okay. So Nidoria will just blow up the uh summon skull over there. Hmm. Could be useful later. Um Go with Chaser. Ooh, actually. No, 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 no. I should make sure there are no trap holes and stuff, so. Okay. Looks like we are in the clear. So, next turn, if he sets something, I can, uh, Mahavilo Fairy Meteor. Oops. End, end turn. No! No! <laughs> I hate car destruction. Yeah, okay. I just got Sook, so that's cool. Damn it! I. Ah! Uh, okay. What is this monster? Oh, Mad Dog. Okay. If it's a vanilla, it's probably big. So, yeah. That makes sense. Uh, okay. The punish would be exactly Penguin Soldier. Or something with 2,000 defense, I guess. Nope, just, uh, just whatever the hell this thing is. Alright. <clears throat> And main phase two, we'll go ahead and set this reinforcements just in case of shenanigans and end. Tan and Well, he did not play anything. So this is game on board if he doesn't have something. Battle phase? Swing with Mad Dog? Activate poison? Oh. Cute. <laughs> okay. Well, now I finally know what that was set all along. Die. Alright, and that wasn't even the match. Yeah. Okay. Oh, right. That's uh, it's not until tomorrow. Okay. Sleep time. What happens if you do this? Does it just skip the tournament? I was kind of hoping for like a funny dialogue box or something. Okay, well, fuck it then. Let's go, let's go. It's like, you were scheduled to be in the tournament, but you didn't show up. It's Bakura. 
It's Bakura. I'm scared. I don't want to go first because he has fucking change of heart. <laughs> He also probably plays card of de card destruction just to annoy me. Alright, uh, what could that be? That could be a lot of things. Um, most of them are scary. But I kind of want to do this. Alright, uh, we won't go with Nuzzler though, just, just in case. But I will go Fairy. That way I can at least get some good damage in. No, it's just Temple Skulls. Okay. Cool. <clears throat> I now have a 2050 Piercer. He's a... He's a bit of a problem to deal with, for sure. Uh, wow, Acts of Despair. You're just begging me to over-equip him, aren't you? <laughs> Let's not, though. Uh, set the Gravekeeper's card. <clears throat> He plays a lot of zero defense monsters, so this is actually a great combo. Yeah, he realizes, I kinda need to play something. Oh shit. He got real big. Okay, well. That is fair, I suppose. I'm a little sad to lose my fairy meteor, but you know. Uh, I could turn it here. That does not get rid of mage power, though, and I kind of need that to happen. So we're going to flip some of the Gravekeeper's Grudge. There we go. Um, I could equip him with the axe to keep him alive. It's not the worst idea in the world. Yeah. He's a big 2,000 bodies on him. It's not... It's nothing to sneeze at. To scoff at. To write off. Etc. Etc. Um, Master Kionchi. I assume you're attacking my face now. Um... I think I win here? No, I'm short. Uh, Chaos Necromancer goes to what? 300? That's like literally exactly lethal. Oh, Kaiku. Well, yeah, okay, battle. Okay, well, I do also have Malevolent Nuzzler in hand. So let's go ahead and do that. Might as well go on the Gravekeeper's card. Just, just make him absurdly huge. Why did I set the Kaiku? Because button pressing. <laughs> That's why. Okay. Um... I win! Yay! Uh, pfft. I have no reason to side deck anything. Well, let's go. I guess I could side deck Ryukoku. That'd be a terrible idea. Okay, um, let's see what we got. I see some Skull and Sand Game, which is a, a great opener as always. If I had a way to protect the sand game, it'd be, it'd be even better. But, sadly. Um... Let's go with Gemini. I would have been punished for a trap hole, but apparently I'm okay. And next turn I'll have seven tools set for trap hole tra uh, torrential, so... Seems good. Seems good. Okay. What you got? Not a whole lot. Okay. <laughs> uh, ooh, Nuzzler. Ooh. 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 Okay. I just want to full Michael Jackson. Um, I guess I could do Kaiku, but it's, uh, let's just set the same game. Just in case one of those new set cards is, uh, Sakurat's Armor, um, Mirror Force or whatever. Is Sakurat's Armor in this game? 
Just look it up. Because if it is, I kind of need it. Yaronzo. Sort of deep-seated. Cool. Does not get over Gemini Alpha, well enough. Alright. Uh, same game. Search for... Guard? Suka's actually pretty good in this matchup. Um... Yeah, let's go Sukuyami. This actually breaks his, um, tie with the thing. Oh, I can also just do this, I guess. No magic jammer. And start a deep seed, it just goes to the top. Which I am perfectly fine with. Um, let's go Kaiku. That way he can't banish anything. I don't know what he would if he could, but, uh, you know, plays around that bird dragon, I guess. Okay, um, let's see what you got. Both of these, yep. Mm -hmm. Get rid of him. Get him out of here. Direct him. Boop you. Alright, uh, well, I'm pretty much gonna win, unless he pulls something crazy. Nope. Alright. Uh, let's go Nuzzler on Elf and go for the win. Alrighty. Well, I say I redeemed myself from that first match we had today. Because I'm a little- I'm still a little mad about it, though. Ah, I lost. Maybe I should study it more on the heart of the cards that Yugi keeps mentioning. Why was he British in the English version? <laughs> it's something that actually makes no sense. <laughs> but we did it. We won the weekend tournament. We got 700 more DP. Let's get through more packs and call it a night. Two short streams this week. Might have to do a third. I've been thinking about actually... Super monster? What the fuck is that? I'm curious. Um... I was gonna get, like, some of Volume... Ooh, tens of available. Um, I was gonna get some of Volume 9, but whatever. I wanna, I wanna see what this is all about. So, we'll get one of those and one of those. Alright. But yeah, I was thinking of doing, like, a grind stream. Um, on, like, Saturday or whatever. But I've got time. Uh, Great Mammoth of Gold. Okay. Visor Shock. When this card is normal, summon, flip, summon, or special summon, return all set cards on the field to their owner's respective hands. You know, this would be interesting if it wasn't level 5. <laughs> um, Gravekeeper Spear Soldier is a piercer boy. Which can be good if you have Necro Valley, and then he'll be 2,000 attack. And Death Kangaroo! When the attack of a monster that attacks this monster is lower than the defense of this monster, destroy the attacking monster. Okay, so... It's sort of like a weird, non-functioning version of Maneater Bug. But it also outs 1600 beaters. <laughs> yeah. Okay, moving on. Let's, what's this? Wow, there's some good stuff in this bag. Holy shit. Got Sousa Soldier. He's pretty freaking good. Except for the whole half damage thing. Fushi no Tori. It's also a spirit. Um, this card inflicts battle damage and increase your life points by an amount. Okay, that's that's kind of shit. But a second Tsukuyomi I'll take. I'll take that with happiness. I wish I could do something with it. Alright. Well... Yeah, um, we'll see if that grind stream happens, so be sure to keep an eye on Twitter. 
And on that note, uh, that is all for this episode of Let's Play Yu-Gi-Oh! World Championship 2005, Seven Trials to Glory. Um, until then, don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. If you do subscribe, ring the little bell, notifications on all my uploads, and in the description down below are links to my Twitch and Twitter accounts, so follow those for more streaming goodness. Uh, sorry, Jamata. Save. Yes.